Hey everyone, welcome back to this channel. If you are looking to play Android games with built-in key mapping, I've got the perfect solution for you. PrimeOS is an amazing operating system that comes with default key mapping for Android games. Sounds great, right? In this video, I'll guide you step by step on how to install PrimeOS on Windows PC. Without getting much more to it, let's get started. So, first of all, open the browser and search for PrimeOS. Open the very first link. And now, on the device, click on here. If you're using laptop or desktop, then select x86. And if you're using Raspberry Pi, then you can select Raspberry Pi. I'm using desktop, then I'll select x86. Then select version. I'm selecting 2.1.3, that is Android 11 86. And if you're using low end specs PC, like below 8GB of RAM, then you can use Android 7. This will be great for you. So selecting them. Now, on the top, you'll have to select ISO. Now click on download now. Now you'll have to wait for 5 seconds. Download will be started. Now, now again search for Rufus. Open the first link. Scroll a little bit. Download the latest one from there. When everything is downloaded, close the browser. Now open this PC. Go to downloads and you'll find primaries and Rufus. Now you'll have to insert a pen drive to PC minimum 8 gigabytes. Now double tap on Rufus. Click on yes. Click on yes. Now select PrimeOS and drag and drop it to the repos. Close File Explorer and click on the drop down select GPT and now click on start. But before clicking on the start, make sure that everything on your pen drive is backed up because in this process, your pen drive will be completely erased. Now click on start. Click on OK. Click on OK. Click on OK. Now you'll have to wait. 10 to 15 minutes to complete the process. Now, when it's completed, click on close. Now, right click on the start menu, select disk management. Now, you'll have to create a drive with a size of 50 gigabytes minimum. Right click on a bigger drive, click on shrink volume, click on shrink. Now, you can see an allocated space has been created. Right click on it, select a new simple volume, click on next, click on next. Click on next. Put the drive name as PrimeOS. Click on next. Click on finish. Now you can see it's done. Now you can close it. Now, let's start your PC and access the boot menu of a PC. To access the boot menu, you can have this photo. Otherwise, you can search in Google. Now, in the boot menu, select open drive and hit on the enter key. Now, in the screen, select PrimeOS 2.1.3 installation and hit on the enter key. Now use your down arrow key and select PrimeOS Drive and click on OK. Now here select EXT Pearl and hit on the enter key. Now choose Yes and hit on the enter key. Now again choose an Yes and hit on the enter key. Now you'll have to wait 10 to 15 minutes to complete the installation. Now when the installation is completed, select Reboot and hit on the enter key. Now, when a PC is restarting, go to Bash menu of a PC. To access the Bash menu, go to this photo, otherwise we can search in Google. Go to Settings, and here, go to Boot section, and here you'll have to change your boot priority to Android x86. Now, press up 10 on your keyboard, click on the Yes, the PC will be booted. Now, in the screen, select PrimeOS and hit on the Enter key. Now, click on Proceed. Set your username and time zone and click on proceed. Accept terms and conditions. Now you can see it's ready. Congratulations, you have successfully installed PrimeOS Dual Boot with Windows. If you find any problem or any error, please let me know in the comment section below.